Have you ever had customers get confused when shopping in the store? Maybe they are not sure which color they are selecting, especially for a combo of bundle products. That little friction can cause trouble to lost confidence and abandon their cart. And the good news is, there is the simple way to fix it. I'm Zoli from Nesco, and today we will show you how to use a average in Nes as watches in the Shopify Horizon team. By the end, your product page will look more professional, visual, and user friendly, helping customers instantly choose the right options and boosting the sales. Before we set everything up, let's quickly look at what makes Horizon Teams different from your team. The Zation data structure inside the Horizon Teams is very different, and it gives you a lot more customizations compared to the Dawn Team. To show you what I mean, let me open my store, which is currently running the Horizon Team, and go into the customizer so you can see how it works. Now, Horizons introduce something called global blocks, which means you can use the same blocks anywhere across the team. While in the Dawn team, each section only has its own limited set of blocks. For example, if I add a new section like a hero banner, I can see the banner settings and below that, there is an option to add blocks. When I click Add Block, the list is much richer because these are global blocks. I can add the different types of blocks like logos and conditions and more. On top of that, Horizons also lets you the insert videos into banners or even use AI to generate images directly in the customizer. If you would like a full step by step on the setting the Horizon team, take a link popping up in the right corner of this video. Alright, now let's start turning variant image into scratches. From the Shopify admin, go to the apps section, search for NS Color Swatch variant images, click install to add it to your store. I leave the link in the description if you prefer to DIY. Now that the apps is installed, let's configure it for Horizon 10. In the admin, go to apps, click NS Color Swatch Variant Images, and click go to team setting to continue. Toggle on the Horizon team, then click confirm to save. Next, click edge product. Choose the product you want to configure. Here, I will pick the top bag. Click save and it's now added to the dashboard. You can see all the product variants. Click the edit icon next to each variant. In the pop-up, select the corresponding image for that variant. Click save and repeat this for each variant until you are done. Now, let's check it on the storefront. On the product page, the swatches under the title now display as a real images of each variant. When a customer clicks on black, the main product photo instantly changes to the black bag. Click browse and it's updated to the brown version. This small change makes your store far more visual, interactive and conversational friendly. And if you want to take it a step further, NS Color Swatch Variant Images offer a combined listing feature, grouping separate products into one listing, so customers can see all back options together. It's a powerful way to boost visibility, clicks, and overall shopping experience. And that is it. Have you thus learned how to use version in this watches in the Shopify Horizon tips? This setup not only look great, but also give your customer confidence when shopping, which directly helps your sales. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like and share, and check out my other Shopify tutorials for more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, I will see you in the next video.